Kogurasumaru is one of the most famous swords in Japanese history. Its history dates back to the late Nara period, 710 to 794 to the mid Heian period, 794 1185. It was originally a family heirloom of the Taira clan, bestowed upon them by the emperor, and is currently treasured as a private property of the imperial family. Kogurasumaru is a tachi, a type of long sword. It is the oldest sword among the imperial family's possessions, and is designated as a national treasure. The blade is approximately 62.8 cm long, the tang is 19.9 cm long, and the motohaba width at the base of the blade is 3.25 cm, making it a relatively large sword. The swordsmith is traditionally said to be Amakuni, but there is no definitive proof. The blade has a flowing Koitamahata small board, grain and a Suguha straight hamon blade pattern. The creator of Kogurasumaru is generally believed to be the legendary swordsmith Amakuni. However, Amakuni is a figure shrouded in mystery, said to have been active during the Nara or Heian period. He is considered the founder of Japanese swordsmithing, but his existence is purely legendary. The name Kogurasumaru comes from a legend that a giant three-legged crow flew down to Emperor Kanmu. 737 to 806 carrying the sword in its beak. Kogurasumaru was first given to Taira no Sadamori, 825 to 880 by the emperor for his role in quelling the Johei Tenkei rebellion 877 to 881. It was then passed down within the Taira clan and cherished as a family heirloom. However, it was believed to have sunk into the sea. Along with Emperor Antoku 1178-1185 at the Battle of Dan no Ura 1185. It was later rediscovered and passed down to the Tokugawa Sogonate during the Edo period 1603-1868. After the Meiji Restoration 1868, it was presented to the imperial family. Kogurasumaru is said to be extremely sharp, capable of splattering blood like crows when it cuts someone. Taira no Kiyomori 1118-1181 is said to have worn Kogurasumaru on the battlefield and cut down enemies one after another. Kogurasumaru was also believed to be a sacred sword, with the power to protect its owner. Kogurasumaru is a precious treasure that embodies Japanese history and culture. It is currently kept by the Imperial Household Agency as an imperial family heirloom. It is not open to the public, so its actual appearance cannot be seen. However, replica blades of Kogurasumaru are exhibited at the following locations. Its beauty, sharpness, and mysterious power continue to fascinate people.